fight every pony. Well, welcome to another video. And today we're, we're going to be regarding Total Drama Rama Season 2. And as you know, I'm super excited. And this is actually the first time I, I've ever been ha happy in January. Because January is supposed to be the month of despair. But I just want to tell- But I'm not making this episode- This video to tell you I'm excited or anything. I'm- I'm making this video to tell you all that- Uh- I'm not- I don't think I'll be that excited as I thought I was. I mean, the pilot episode- Oh, it sounds really wonky. Eh. And I was expecting something a little different. I mean, it's... Um, did you ever think... What in the world kind of episode idea is a talking Mickey glove? My apologies for anyone who owns a talking glove. And, which I doubt that. <laughs> but anyway, so... This is just all... All I... One thing I have to say... And... Is that this episode idea is, is pretty bad. I don't even think I want to watch it. Besides, the episode already got in the sneak peek, but I feel like I'd rather wait. Because of this whole... Talking glove thing. But I feel like I should make the nutshell right now, considering the fact that it's out and that my nutshell should be out right now. But that's your decision. Let me know. Let me know in the comments. And if, if even one of my fans say yes, I'm gonna I'm gonna watch the episode, then make the nutshell. <laughs> it was funny that in my 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 other my last in that show I made a special appearance by Dog Man. I just couldn't resist it when I saw that Chef dressed as a dog to save the day. But that's not not what this video was regarding. It's regarding how how weird this episode is. You know, in fact, in my opinion, I think he mo of I think. I think a small amount of total drama on that episode sound wonky. Like when I first heard about the Wiener Takes All episode, I I thought it was very weird. And Apocalypse Now, uh, I didn't find that I didn't find that I didn't find that pretty wonky, but I did find it creepy. Uh, because after all, there. Why would they mention such a, such a j humongous, this childhood problem in a kids show? That's just so dumb. I feel like that should be illegal. I, I'm serious. Fresh TV shouldn't, shouldn't have done that. Oh. <laughs> That's just mean. It freaked some of us out. That's why I was I was originally planning on, on watching that episode for a last. Out of the new episodes. But then it ended up being Wiener Takes All when I decided to watch watch that that one that one episode oh next just to get it off my back I 
was so freaked out. It feel, felt like I was gonna, gonna throw up. What or should I even have to do the next part of my I Smash and Crash Let's Play for me? And I got a lot of bad luck after watching that one episode. Puss and Boots got lost on camera. I got a terrible headache. And and one and at one point at school, the school I I was playing quiz. We were playing quiz live, and we lost when when we had one question left. That's just so much bad luck. I couldn't take it, so I had to. So I decided to. I had to do something to break this, break the curse. <laughs> so. I just did a few stuff here and there, and then. Poof. I... I guess it wasn't much of a poof. But still... I mean... Uh, the curse is... The ba my bad luck is gone now. And... And back to topic. Creepy drama rama episodes. I... I just want to say when I first heard about No More Mr. Nice Guy, I was gonna do that, that one, and as one of my last ones, until Rainbow just uh, wanted me to watch it next, and, I mean, I'm not mad at you, Rainbow, I, it's just, I, I'm disappointed. You saw that episode way before me, and, and you could have told me that, uh, that, that, ep and you, and, and you would have knew that episode would make me cry. And, and of course you didn't tell homie and wanted me to do, do the episode just because you like it. What in the world kind of villain would mess with my boyfriend? Seriously? They didn't just mess with my boyfriend, they killed him! <clears throat> of course one. Of course they also tried to kill the rest. So... Another episode I find weird... Is one of the one of the earlier episodes, Germ Factory. When I first heard about that episode, I I was just all like, "What the? F what the? Oh, yeah." I I was so weirded out that I had I just had to watch that episode. And it turns out, it was a good call. Apparently, getting sick on purpose, as to them, is good. Come on, that's terrible. Oh, by the way, if you're wondering what's behind me, behind me, I actually built the daycare in Minecraft. That's cool. And Complete with the tree house. And, and yeah, anyway. So, another weird drama on that episode. One of the later ones, and, and that's the fly one. At first, I was really excited for that one, to watch that one, because I. I thought there would be ah, oh, we, cool and awesome adventure, but it turns out 
Nah! Fake out there. They had, had to make it all fake. You know, fan, fans are fans are satisfied when are the most satisfied when something happens for real. Let's take let's take take certain books for example. The, people hate it when certain books end end when it all turns out to be a dream. And you know why? Because they want to believe it's the real deal. And and when and when. In the show, to, and when sh shows and books don't do that, fans are just infuriated. Though I will admit, having that fly episode be the real deal would have been and very awful, because the kid, his were idiots that day. They thought Harold died. Seriously, that's sad. Then he thought he was a, they thought he was a zombie just because he because he came out in the exact hole that they buried the fly in. <laughs> that, I will admit that part's funny. And you know what I think the only funny part in, in the Lice episode was? That's... And that's with Cody. He kept saying rice. <laughs> <laughs> Lol. <laughs> that's so... That part was the only funny thing. You know, one time I... You know... You know, the reason I'm... I'm, I'm, I'm even in love with Cody is because, because I felt bad for his teen self. Seriously. Some random bear just came in and beat him up. That's just so mean. You know, I think, and that, and after that, uh, I decided, I did that I'm Cody, his girlfriend, and just made him and Fluttershy really good friends. And, oh, back to topic. Uh, also, there are other episodes I find weird. Is well, the skunk one. I don't really care. <laughs> oh, eh. and also there, there sooner or later, the first first episode that reminds me of Spiral the Dragon. All because Dun Duncan and ended up being dressed as a dragon. You know, it would have had more effect effect of it. It was if if it looked more like Spyro, then it would add more reference. But I'll bet at first TV doesn't even know what's you know what creature Spyro is. But, but from my first statement, there's nothing worse than, there's nothing worse than, than watching a total drama-rama episode that storyline is, is weird.